Hi everyone, so welcome to Salsa Arms, Upper Body. So today we're going to do six rounds of a minute each and you're going to have 20 seconds rest in between each round. So you're making sure that your space is nice and clear and making sure that you're fit and healthy and well enough to do your exercise, no injuries. If you haven't done exercises for a long time or you have an injury, please check with your doctor or your healthcare professional before you start this workout. Okay, so choose some weights that you may have some um, small dumbbells available in your house. If you don't, then you could use water bottles or you could use baked bean cans, okay? So then focus on your technique and get the movement um, correct first of all. And then you can build some weight in. So using weight that you're not, uh, your technique's not suffering with, but it's heavy enough to give you that challenge. Slow down wherever you need to, rest out wherever you need to, okay? So we are gonna start with, we've got squat to press. To begin with, if you don't wanna do the press, you can, uh, sorry, the squat, you can just do the press, or we can add that in. So it looks like this, press. Coming down, little dip, press through. Second exercise is bent forward row. So we hip hinge forward, keeping the spine nice and straight, holding the weights in front, pulling back, shoulder blades together, and lowering the hands down, keeping the weights closer to the body and lower. Then we've got your press up position. So you've got the options to press from the wall. You've got the options to come down into your four point uh, kneeling position, hands wide in the shoulders, chest to floor, lift into your three-quarter press or into your full press if you can and then your elbow is going back at a 45 degree angle okay so you don't want the elbows out to the side don't need them stead close we're taking them 45 degrees down chest to the floor press away breathe out on the way up okay so choose your options for that one side lateral raise with the weights and then we're going into front raise and then to finish we've got a plank and you can use the hand weights, to, uh, hand weights to row up or we can do the plank without, okay? So you choose. So I'm gonna start the music, get the timer ready for that one minute. And we're starting with squat to press, so grab your weights. Now you're making sure you lift your weights up by bending through the knees, weights close to your body, lift up. So feet, hip width apart, so I bend the knees, start, let's go. Breathing in and out, so you squat, lift, press. your body under control. Lovely. Breathe out as you press up. Excellent. Nice and strong. Nice and tall. Halfway. Excellent. Slight nod with the chin so you've got that nice length in the back of your neck. Breathe out. Control the arms down. Equal weight through each foot. Breathe out. Nearly there. Excellent. And again, don't be afraid to swap the weight. You need to. If you want to lower the weight down, part way through. Lovely. Excellent. Take the weight down. Have a little rest. Breathe in and out. Get ready for the next one. Bend forward row. So taking that weight. Lift up. Shoulder blades back and down. Chest lifted. Hip hinge coming forward. Drop the weight down in front. Breathe in and out. Spine nice and straight. Elbow and tucked under. Row back and down. Breathing out and in. Length through your spine. Take your bottom back. Squeeze and lower. Breathe out as you lift. In as you go back. Keep your body nice and still. Core strong. Lovely. Excellent. Chest lifted. Breathe out and in. Lower down under control. Lovely. With it halfway, breathing out and in. Now, at any stage you need to rest, just take it up, shake it through, come back down, arms in front, do it again. Here we go, it just depends on what weight you've got. Lowering the weight if you need to, or increasing the weight if that feels right. And again, the heavier the weight, the more recovery time you're going to need in between your sets. Lovely, I'm going to swap to a lighter weight. Excellent. Bend the knees as you lower down. Keep the weight close to your body. Lovely. Shoulder blades back and down. Okay. Front raise this time. Hands close to your thighs. Body up nice and tall. Lovely. Core strong. Get ready for that single arm in front down. Shoulder raise. 
left. So tuck your tailbone under, little squeeze on the glutes, keep the core strong. So you've got neutral pelvis. Standing up nice and tall. Excellent, shoulder height and down. So we're not swinging the weight. You can bring both arms if you want to. There's too much for your lower back. Singles. Slow up, down. Control it. Keep that core nice and strong. Lovely, make sure you're using the weight that's right for your body. Breathing in and out. Excellent. Halfway, over halfway now. You got this. Lift the lower. Breathing out and in. Now if you need to wait and rest now, take a rest. Have a longer recovery, yeah? As the weeks go by, you can build it up. Technique most important. Excellent. And then when the weight becomes too easy, you're going to increase it, yeah? As the next weeks go by. Lovely. Rest it out. Pop the weight down if you want to. Shake the arms out. We've got side lateral raise. We're going to start singles, then together. Take the weight. Rest longer if you need to. Arms in front. Shoulder blades back and down. Chest nice and open. Toe and tuck down that. Push through the feet. Here we go. So lift, down. Singles. Keep the body still or doubles. Elbows slightly bent. So breathing out here. Little glutes squeeze. So you've got neutral pelvis alignment. Spine nice and tall. Here. Breathe out. Control down. Lovely. And again. Excellent. Now you might not want to make it smaller. Singles if you want to. Take a rest if you need to. Otherwise, nice and strong. Working the side of your shoulders over halfway now. So you can mix it up. You can give me some singles. I'm going to challenge that core. As that lifts, your body will move the other way. Stabilize yourself. All together. And again. done your run, you've worked your legs and you want to add that upper body part to your workout and rest it down. Okay, pop the weight down to the side or in front, press ups next. So you've got your option, wall press up or four point kneeling, chest to the floor lift or onto your knees, wall press up if you want to, rest out whenever you need to, shoulder blades back and down, chest to the floor, lower lift. 45 degrees back, press away from the floor, breathe out, breathe in. Now press ups are really hard, so if you need to, you can modify. So you'll come down, push, back into child pose, come back up, lower down, push back up, child's pose. Lovely, and then back up, lower down, left. So you choose, here, halfway, over halfway. Now, guys, doing really well, and then you can do it all the way down left. Now, making sure it's your chest going to the floor, not your nose and your chin. Bend through the elbows, chest goes down, press away, breathe out. You need something under the knees, take it there. Last few, come on, we got this. Press away, breathe out. Strong through the core, lovely. One full up, push it back. Lovely. Up onto your toes. Rolling up. Okay, last one we're going to end with is your plank. You can use your weights if you want to, or leave them out. In fact, I'm going to choose lighter ones. So you can go into your plank, or use the weights. Here we go. Breathe in. Down. Roll out. Ear centre. Four. Lower. Keep that core nice and strong. Here. Keep your hips as still as you can. It's too much for the weight. Drop it out. Just hold it here. Tuck the tailbone under. Squeeze the glutes. Short leg back and down. Arm hips towards each other. Breathe in and out. If it's too hard, bring it down. Take the hands down. Three quarter. Option here. Or come up. Over halfway now. Breathe in. Well done. Breathe in through the nose. 
Breathe it out. Lovely. Walk it up onto your toes. Keep your knees bent. Bring it all the way up. Take a breath in. And breathe out. Lovely. And again. Watch the weights around you. No tricks. Here we go. Lovely. One more time. So, we've done the core salsa. We've done the legs. Now we've done the upper body. Next one is going to be fitness pilates. A little bit more relaxing. Ten minutes. A little bit of core. Working on the breathing and calming the nervous system down. Okay, so that'll be beginning the next couple of days. Well done. Take care. Bye.